So what was your upbringing like for you with like regarding family or just in general with your life in the early days? Yeah, um, I was lucky with my upbringing because my parents exposed me to a lot of arts and music and just um, like since the er really early age, I was going to a lot of uh, classes. Um, you know, I was in ballet and theater. I took piano lessons since I was three. I, I went to a full on music school. So I was exposed to it from when I was really young and we went to a lot of shows and concerts and I always was in love with, you know, anything, um, performance, um, you know, performing arts and just culture in general. I loved going to art galleries and I got to travel quite a bit. So um, I was lucky in that regard. And then when we moved to the United States, um, you know, it was a quite a big change, but I feel like uh, I've adapted and uh, it was new experiences and I loved going to New York as well. That was a, um, a whole new adventure for me. And then, of course, moving to L.A. So I feel like my background kind of helped me navigate the world. <laughs> so how was it like when you first moved to Los Angeles to start your career in music? Uh, it was, you know, when I moved here, I was trying to do a lot of different projects and just kind of uh, survive in L.A., I guess. So I uh, didn't just start in music. I did a lot of different um, theater projects and film projects, but I met Dave, who's the guitarist and co-founder of Edge of Paradise pretty early on. And uh, yeah, we kind of started the band right away. But you know, it's not easy moving to a whole new state. Uh, you know, I was really young at the time, uh, but um, somehow <laughs> it all worked out. Mm -hmm. so. So, so tell us about your how the band came about and how long you've been doing, uh, how long you've been the co-founder and the lead singer of your band for? Uh, so we started, well, we met in, mm, I forget when, <laughs> it's, been, it's been quite a long time ago. I've been in LA for over 10 years now. So when we first met, um, like we were doing other projects and we were just kind of working together on, you know, trying to figure out, uh, we didn't even start writing music right away because Dave had a lot of songs left over that he wrote with Robin McCauley, who he was in the band with before me. And I I never really sang before or in, especially in a rock group. I never imagined I would be in a rock group. I was always, you know, I did piano and I did some musical theater, but I never moved to LA to become a singer or anything like that. So, you know, I it gave me a good opportunity when I sang over the songs he already have just to kind of figure out, you know, how to I uh, guess I wanted to sound like, you know, just you have to start somewhere, I guess. Uh, mm -hmm. But we what we aligned is we really were passionate about creating something and following through with it and dedicating all our energy and time into it. But really, it took us years to figure out how to write s songs together because we came from such different backgrounds. Um, so I think in 2017, when we released universe i think that's when it really defined the sound of edge of paradise and that's kind of when i feel like now the band really started because anything before that we did put out songs together like the first song we wrote together was in a dream and i still really love the song but when you hear that music it doesn't sound anything like us but yeah so that's kind of the background a little bit <laughs> 